pretty much every day. I've got people who are pointing to me saying, okay, Jeff, I got a problem in my neck and it's right here. Why? Because I feel pain all on this side. So that's where the problem is, right? Well, not always. Here's the reason why. When we've got issues that are affecting our body, particularly our spine and our neck, our spine is a midline structure. It's located down the middle part of us. So when we have problems, we're gonna have combinations of issues that can affect either the one side or the other. Let's say I do this with my head as an example. What's happening is, is I am compressing the structures on this side. And in the same breath, I'm getting tension on the other side. The question then is, what's most likely going to give way first? And the honest answer is, is we have no idea what that's going to be. But if you're having compression on one side, what this is typically going to do is this is going to cause pressure irritation to cartilage, to ligaments, to joints, things like that. And it's going to make them feel uh, really pinpoint gnarly. At the same time, we're going to be having stretching occurring of the muscles and ligaments on the other side. What's that going to feel like? That's going to feel like pulling, stretching, all of these other kinds of different things. And in terms of what's happening with the nerve receptors in that area, well, you can have pretty much anything going on. What I've just described to you is a situation where you can have symptoms on either this side or this side. And the question is, well, where is the problem? We don't know. Not based on that information, you need a little bit more. And this is the reason why we don't base where do we need to do treatment, where do we need to adjust, where do we need to help your neck necessarily based on exactly where the symptoms are because the symptoms can happen on either side. And if we end up focusing on where the pain is, we may not actually be getting to where the problem is. So if you've been experiencing discomfort, pain, pulling, compression, tension, really in any part of your body, let me ask you this very important question. If those are the effects, and they are, where is the primary issue coming from? And what kinds of tests have you had done to pinpoint not just where the pain is, but why are those areas under compression? Why are those areas under tension? And most importantly, what needs to be done or what can be done in order to help you overcome them as much as possible. It may not tell you exactly what you need to do in this moment, but I hope that that does explain how and why you can have issues on either part of your body and why it requires that somebody's having a more detailed look to really pinpoint where it's coming from. Hope you've enjoyed watching this video and we'll see you next time. This is For more information about upper cervical care, please call us on 31889329 or visit us at atlashealth.com.au.